One of the things the AP tends to do in major events is do what's called in the industry a TikTok, a reconstruct of what happened and how it happened and how it unfolded. And it's often done in a narrative style and a present tense to put you in the moment as much as possible. And one of my first assignments when I got to Littleton after the shooting was to take what we call feeds from other reporters, do some of my own reporting, and pull together a sense of what it was like. And so my first exposure to all of this beyond the breaking news was probably 200 files, each one, and when I say files, I mean computer files, each one containing a quote or two paragraphs of description or something that happened. And to pull those fragments together into something coherent that could tell the story of these this very strange day inside this high school. I look back on it now and I see that those fragments that came into me were very much like how Twitter unfolds today. Uh, you know things bit by bit. You don't always have a coherent narrative. And as journalists, we're responsible for pulling it together in a way that makes sense, but also doesn't impose a false narrative on it. And that's always tough.